Hey guys, what up? It's Slim, and welcome to Road to Riches episode number three. Now, I know I've just been really doing Road to Riches episodes for a bit now, but... Yeah, I hope to put out a, um, The Money Making Guide Part 3 this next episode coming up here. Um, before the next episode of this, which should be over the weekend. Um, this was the Frost Dragons episode that I thought I lost, but I just had it titled something completely stupid. So, I mean, I found it, and then I thought, uh... I'll throw it in, I guess, real quick. So basically, this is just what I do for money a lot. Or, um... Or, um... B -b 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 what do you call it? Uh, sorry, Grenwalls. Or Grenwalls. I'm uh, getting 99 range at Frost Dragons. I'm not maxing my account here. Because, um... I want to max out through Slayer. And, uh... Not Monkeys, or... Uh... Whatever they're called. But, um... I just want to do it through Slayer. And then... Finish maxing uh, range here, so that's about it. Um, so this is basically just my standard Frost Dragons setup. I don't have a DFS. This is just from like a while ago, like a week ago. So yeah, uh, this week I haven't done too much. I did some questing. I did some other things. I finished all the dwarfs, all the dwarf, uh, the dwarf series. Like I did King of the Dwarves, and. It's a pretty easy quest, uh, quest storyline. It's quite enjoyable, in my opinion, here. Um, so, yeah. We'll get into the crafting section right here. Hey guys, what up? It's Slim here. And I just recorded this, but I realized I wasn't a commentary. So, basically, I'm just going to go over what I did before. So, once again, hey guys. Um, I'm just doing lava flow mining, you can see here, I am 70, I'm 73 mining, and I got 5 levels. 5 levels is, I don't know, I got it in 2 days, uh, I've gotten 3 pieces of the armor, armor so far. Um, I got 1 level from doing the quests, and then I basically got the rest here. So I guess 4 levels and 3 pieces, but I've probably missed at least 1 nymph so far, AFK, I'm playing Minecraft, lots of fun. Um, so I guess you don't know, I usually, whenever I train woodcutting, I usually play Minecraft, or sometimes when I just get bored, I go on Minecraft for like 30 or 40 minutes, and then come back to RS. Um, so yeah, basically, I'm just mining away, got my uh, three pieces on, I can't wait to get the top and bottom, that's going to be epic, and it's going to look cool. So, I have not done, I have done a bit this week. Uh, I got 75 RC, goal accomplished there. Um, I'll basically give you the rundown what's going to happen this week, hopefully, unless as long as I don't um, stop mining. Uh, I hope to get 76 mining, which is what I need for the quest. Uh, that's the last requirement I need for the quest, other than the other quest to actually do the quest. And I just want to get the skills out of the way, then just quest. As you can see there, it's the quest, quest, quest for the this week's goals. If I put the right one in for the intro, um, I change the that part of the intro every week for my different goals. Um, and so yeah, basically I got two summoning levels. I got one agility level. I got one agility level opening on my effigies. Four, instead of getting crafting assists with my beast agility level, I can go into the clan citadels and open them up. So that's really, really cool. Um, I got two... Uh, summoning levels just off of effigies alone, which is nice. And I'm gonna start using my penguin points and stuff on this and instead of RC, because I'm going for 88 right now, which is a unicorn for people who do not know what 88 unlocks, and that's something very very good. Um, it'll help me at glaciers once I get them unlocked or glade cores or however you pronounce them. Um, I was planning on doing a bit of DKs this week to help make some money. But um, some fags think it's kind of cool to DDoS me, so I, for the past couple days I was getting DDoSed very, very often. Um, but I haven't been so much now, but after I make this video, um, it was someone who I thought was a good friend. But obviously one mil is more important than uh, friendship. So basically, I'm not going to tell this happened, I didn't scam anyone, I didn't take money from anyone, but he thinks I am a mil. Um... Basically, yeah, so I didn't get to go to DDKs at all or anything. I kind of wanted to do DDKs, but that's just another thing. 
Um, I got one herb lore level. Um, basically, I made a hundred overloads and a bunch. I had the pots. I got really close to level. Got the level. Got like a hundred something, like 150k XP, opening effigies, and then I assisted for a couple days. Um, but I'm kind of done assisting. I haven't farmed in forever, guys. I need to get back on top of that because I need to get 80 so I can make my uh, potions. But that's that, that's. I'm not going to start using those potions until I get 80 mining, which I'm pretty sure it's 80 for gold ore. Um, I'm not going to start using them till then. So yeah, after I quest, 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 I'm going to get, I'm going to do a little marathon thingy. Not a marathon, but just probably like a 30, 25 minute long video. Let me know if you guys are cool with a longer video like that. I know I especially like those when I'm skilling, so I mean, if you're like... Yeah, I'd love to see a long video. You can leave it in the comments below. Uh, I'm planning on doing probably a little bit of a longer video of just me killing some glaciers and then wrapping up at the end of the week with my glaciers tab. Now, I'm going to try my hardest to keep my tab, but if I get, like, five pairs of steadfasts, I'm going to have to... Uh, no, I probably won't sell them, but, I mean, I'm going to do 1K glacier kills, which I'm hoping will make me at least, like, 20 mil, but, I mean, I don't know. That may not happen. Uh, I'm pretty sure it should, because I mean, I'm, I hear it's about a boot drop in every 20 kills. So I mean, as long as I get like a pair of glavens, I'll be good. Uh, even two rage fires off the other drops in the shards, I should make 20 mil. But I mean, obviously, if I get steadfast, it's like 50, 45 mil right there, just cash in the bank, just from one drop, which is going to be insane. Once I get my first boot drop, I cannot wait for that. That's going to be crazy. Um, because, I mean, that's that's basically why I'm getting them, is because they're good money. I hear, and I hope, and I hope I don't go there, sit there for 1k kills, make, like, 2 mil, lose, like, 10 mil on runes, and then just, like, cry, you know? But, um, that's it, guys. I really haven't done too much. Um, uh, I made the 50 overloads and everything, and I'm just basically going to be mining here until I get 76, and then I'm going to glaciers. Then I'm probably going to come back and try to get 80 mining, and then I'm going to, sorry, yawn. So I'm going to, I don't know what I'm going to do after that. We'll find out. I don't really plan that far ahead. So, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Later during this week, I'm going to try my hardest to make a money-making guide, but if I'm pressed for time, I may not, and um, hopefully I'll make some sort of video, and I hope to get back to making some guides. Once I camp those 1k glaciers, find out how they work, hopefully I'll make a glade cores guide. I call them glaciers and glade cores, I don't know why, I just kind of mix that in there. But, yeah guys, um, thank you so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, I would like you to like the video, and I'll talk to you guys later in another video. And, basically, uh, yeah, you know, just, hmm, I don't know how far I want to get tonight. Hopefully, I would like to get a mining level, but it's 7.30, so we'll see about that. See you later, guys.